a few weeks. So, we are speaking English again today. I'm making you remember it from days long ago when you went to school in England. <laughs> oh, I can barely remember being that young, let alone language. Your mind is as sharp as ever. I only hope your heart is as open as ever. What does that mean, Gabrielle? I, I can't keep this inside any longer. Oh, well, that's why I haven't been to see you. But I can't live with it alone anymore either. Oh, you are making me afraid. I'm a child. I'm pregnant. Oh. And I will start showing soon, the doctor tells me. Oh, please don't think I'm awful. Oh, I... I didn't know there was a man you were close to. There isn't. I mean, there isn't now. But a few months ago, I was very unhappy. You know, Papa treats me like a little girl. He doesn't want me to see anyone. He wants to find a person for me. I felt as though I was suffocating. And then I met this stranger. By accident. I knew the moment he smiled at me that he was in Buenos Aires. into my life, and I fell in love with you. Oh, God, but he is. Papa never knew. We met secretively. I told him I was here at a friend. In quick you do not even know? In America, he said he'd be back, but so far, he hasn't. I've given up hope while the baby grows. I keep pretending I'm gaining weight. For how long? Papa will see. Papa will know. I know he will. I don't know what he'll do. Oh, he will be disgraced. He will send you away to give up this baby. I believe that, too. But I must have the chance to tell the baby's father. He'll marry me. I know he will. And then I won't be a disgrace to our family. I can even move back to America and pretend it all happened there. He love you? He must. <laughs> even if he once did. Many men forget about love when they face responsibility. Not Max. Abuela, you must help me convince Papa to let me go to America. You must help me find the strength to tell Max I'm pregnant with his child. Oh. <laughs> Make sure he never comes back. It infuriates me when I think how smug he was when he found the will in the hidden safe. But Max Holder will see. I don't care that he's moved into Bella Vista. That ranch belongs to me, not to Holden. Okay, first thing you do when you saddle Brock is pick up the saddle and throw it on his or her back. Weighs almost as much as I do. Now, reach under her belly. Why, well, she doesn't want me to reach under her belly. Gonna say hello? Hello? No, I don't think so. Hey, hey. Out here. Obviously a big mistake. Would well, you hear from your old man that I inherited Don Alonzo's ranch? Yes, my father told me, but you didn't. And then I hear from a ranch hand that you've got a wife. Now do you see why 
I made a big mistake. Look, I was going to call you the first thing I settled in. Hmm? What are you so mad about? A lot of things have changed since we were together. I've been betrayed. Shame. You used me. Well, how, well, how did I use you, huh? We've been honest with, with each other, haven't we? It doesn't matter. Just as I never mattered. Listen, we can be friends. Hey, you and Tina are going to love each other. <laughs> I prayed you'd come back. Now I wish God never saw fit to answer my prayers.